good morning it is a monday we have a full week this week we're finally not feeling any kind of sickness which is good um i've also got this new jumper but it's doing this thing where it's a bit short and it's really annoying me because it's a bit cold in here to like pull my sleeves up how i would usually have them for working so i'm just trying to keep warm <laughs> um yeah so this week in a minute i've just got some orders to pack for etsy thank you for your orders this weekend um i've keep getting like a, f a few weekends where i've got a whole bunch of orders and then i come in monday and i'm like got some packing to do because packing is one of my favorite things I think it's just so much different to everything else that I have to do so yeah um, I'm looking forward to doing orders in a minute so thank you for those um, if you do want to place an order I have my new calendars and mushroom bookmarks and obviously all of my cards and everything um, so if you do want to make a purchase for Christmas we've got until I think I've put the 16th of December is the last posting date for the UK. The last posting date for the US is actually today, the 28th, if you want to put in an order for before Christmas. That would be fantastic. This week is going to be a big drawing week because I have two commissions, two double commissions, that I need to get finished and I need to get them, I need to at least get one finished this week. Um, because then it will be Friday is going to end up being the 3rd of December oh, we're into December <laughs> and then the following week will be the 9th 10th, I don't know the dates um, so we'll be working like well into our December and then I've, after that I've only got one more week until James finishes for um, school and then I won't be able to get very much done so my aim is to breeze through these commissions. I'm going to have to put in some evenings this week to try and get them done, which means I will be live streaming on YouTube, but by the time this vlog goes up, you've probably already seen that I had have live streamed on YouTube. Um, so I'm gonna have to put in at least like a couple of evenings, which doesn't mind me so much because I wanted to do like some extra content over December for Christmas and things. Um, so that kind of contributes towards that, except I'm going to start it like today because I need to get them done. I can't start it on the 1st of December because that's Thursday. Um, I also need to gather everything and finalise everything to send stuff off for my tax return to my accountant. So I need to do that this week as well because otherwise if I leave it any longer it's going to be a rush in January and I don't want to be rushing around in January trying to finalise all of that so I want to get it done this side of Christmas so I can just relax and have a nice peace of mind that I've done everything um yeah so I don't know if I've showed you the commission that I started I also need to finish this koala because I was meant to finish that last week and I didn't I need to finish this down fish as well um there's just so much that I need to do and you know when you kind of you know there's a lot that you need to do and you feel like you're kind of falling behind a little bit kind of how I feel this is the commission the double commission that I've been working on I've barely done anything <laughs> so that's gonna be fun um, <clears throat> and then I haven't even started the other one I was meant to start it last week uh, this is the same size thankfully so it's not going to be like two two bigger dog dogs on there um, so thankfully well not thankfully, I was meant to start it last week but because I was sick and I didn't want to do anything and I just couldn't sit and be comfortable, I didn't get anything done last week so I'm like a week behind, otherwise I would have had this one done and the koala and probably some of the fish but it never quite works out when you want it to work out does it, or when you're in like a bit of a time crunch um, yeah, so that's what I'll be doing this week is working on those so these this commission here that I've already started is two spaniels and the other commission is two cairn terriers so lots of 
long-haired dogs <laughs> i want to get this spaniel one done first because i feel like the kern ter terriers are going to be easier because it's not curls and i hate to draw curls like these spaniels um but yeah i need to get them done by the end of next week at least because then they need to be posted because there's more post strikes as well and they need to get there in time for christmas so i definitely need to get it done by the end of next week i had a lot of plans to get a lot of like sea life stuff done during november and december but it hasn't gone that way because i've been sick and time has flown has it flown for anybody else please tell me that it has anyway let's get to doing some work and i'll catch you guys soon This is me in my natural habitat with my blanket wrapped around me whilst I'm going to be recording because I don't want the heater on so I've got to keep warm because it's cold out here. I've just been and had my fingernails done so this is what we're working with for the next couple of weeks. I went a lot shorter because I've got some typing to do and stuff. So now I'm just going to film the rest of the koala. It should take me about half an hour. It's currently 25 past 11, so it should be done by 12. And then I should have about an hour, hour and a half to do some work on the commission. And then I'm going to schedule a live stream, I think for today. I think that's probably best to try and get it done ASAP. Um, yeah, so um, that's where I'm at. finished sorry he was in quite a bit of um, dark there the uh, the lighting in here today is not fantastic that's a little bit better but it makes me look really really shiny <laughs> let's just put this on as well um yeah so the koala is now finished thank thank the lord it's done <laughs> i don't have to worry about completing this tutorial which is good um what i'm going to do is i'm going to edit it really quickly now um so then it's done and then i can leave it to upload whilst i go and pick james up from school and everything 
and then I can schedule it for posting on Patreon. I've still got the previous part, which is part three that I need to post, so I can do that now. I didn't want to post part three before I'd finished the koala because I didn't want to leave it forever between posting the parts. So now I can just concentrate on this commission this week or for today, and then I'm going to work on it all of tomorrow. So I'll work on it this evening as well in a live stream, but then I can work on it today for about oh, probably about half an hour. <laughs> I'll see how much or how quickly I can get these commissions done and everything sorted but yeah um so now i'm just gonna work on commission good morning it is wednesday so yesterday i had a full full day of drawing and it was so nice i just put on some christmas films and just drew and i managed to get the first little portrait done on this double commission so this is how far I got I finished it completely it's so cute so I've just got the other one to do I'm gonna schedule a live stream for this evening um, I'm gonna obviously start that one today as well um, but I'm not going to I really wanted to to push myself to finish that other one um, yesterday. I didn't have to, but I was just like, oh, may as well just get it like over and done with. Um, so this other one, I'm going to do a little bit of drawing on it this morning, but I'm not going to do too much drawing because I'm going to be drawing this evening as well. And I don't want to draw all day today because I ended up with like a sore hand yesterday because I don't think I have drawn for that length of time for a little minute. So. I'm so glad that I got that done and I'm aiming to get the other one done tomorrow because um, I have all day tomorrow to work on that one because where I was at with that first one I had done like the eyes and a little bit of the like eyebrow bridge um, so I'm thinking where I was with that one when I started yesterday and I managed to get the whole thing done I should be able to do the same with this other one. Also, the ears aren't as complicated, so it shouldn't take as long to like map out all of the ears and everything like that. So it should be a lot simpler um, in that respect. Uh, but we'll see how it goes, but I'm hoping to get it done tomorrow, finish tomorrow evening, and then I can start the other double portrait that I have and then get that done next week so that it's ready to send because I don't want to leave it too long before sending it off um, in time for Christmas because these both have to go to the UK so it's not so bad um, but if they were going to the US I definitely wouldn't get them done in time um, but yeah uh, that's my plan and that's what I managed to get done I've got a couple of orders to package up today I've got a card pack I love the card packs um, I don't know why but I just really like going and like picking the card packs and then just packaging them up because it's just really nice and simple. Um, so I've got a couple of orders this morning to package up which is fun fun and fun. Um, I want to, I've realised, sometimes when people put in a larger order I would like to write like a little thank you note and the only way that I can do that is I can't really write on my thank you cards because there's literally like no space there full of information so I wanted to if I wanted to write a note I have to like write it in one of my cards or on a piece of notebook paper so I was wondering whether I try and design some little note cards that are just like A6 um, with like the greetings cards like with the designs on them but then just leave them blank on the back so that people can write like a little note message I'm not sure if that's something that people would be interested in but I'm wondering whether I just order some anyway so that I can have some in stock for myself to write little notes because I also write like just notes um, if I'm sending parcels to friends or something and I never have anything like like a note card to write on if that makes sense so I might 
this afternoon or a little bit this morning maybe i don't know um just have a little look at designing some note cards um but then not necessarily releasing them until the new year i'm going to try that thing where i accumulate a bunch of products and then do shop launches in the future and one of my like goals for 2023 is to or before the year starts is to like really just sort out my shop and just have like a new range of products to launch and everything so i need to try and get that done in the next couple of weeks for things that i need and like you know get everything ready for the new year but anyway let's um go to package these orders and then we need to get on with some drawing I decided to just print off some little um, mocks of A6 like little note cards. I'm just going to slice them up and see how they look. Me being me, I couldn't get the A6 size right, but this is close enough. Um, this one looks a bit stupid, uh, so I probably won't go with the hoopo. But I think I might bring back this one. I could even print these off and do them myself, because they come out quite good. Um, but I think I might just send them off for a printer. Um, this one, again, not the right... Not the right size, but you can get the idea. And then I quite like the iris. The iris looks quite good, but yeah, again, this is um, not the right size, but it kind of gives you an idea of how it would how it would look. But I'm going to write a little note to go in with the order because it's a gift order on this. And then I'm going to have a little play around with a few other designs and things um, and see if I can come up with some note cards for the shop for the new year but I'll keep these because then I can write them if ever I have like a little another little note that I need to add started the eye um it's good going uh so this morning i was a little bit distracted and i decided to do those a6 cards and i really want to get designing some of them because i'm like oh, i just have so many ideas for new products for the new year and I just I like want to get started on them and I want to do it now but I also need to finish this because if I don't finish this that's not very good but I will get this finished um I'm going to the gym at quarter past 12 today so I need to leave at 12 so I've got an hour so I've got about 45 minutes um left of drawing so I should be able to get like you can see the reference photo behind me um I should be able to get uh oh my god I can never work out which way to go <laughs> 
like the little eyes and like the little gingery eyebrow bits above the eyes that's where i got to when i started my live stream on the other one um on monday so i'd had like this both eyes and then like the little eyebrow bits and then during the live stream i like did underneath the eye and then the bridge between the eyes so i'm hoping to get both of the little eyebrow bits done and then i can be like at the same point that i was with the live stream on monday but with this dog and then tomorrow i can get it all completely finished fingers crossed um but i decided to uh open up my box of boxes because i hadn't done that and then i can put that out for recycling and then i also decided to print off a bunch of my print certificates and because i've got like a bunch of prints just sitting down sitting down there then one's there um and they don't have like, a lot of them don't have the print certificates uh, so i just printed them out and then i've like labeled them and got them all ready so i decided to do that i know i didn't really need to but i just wanted to get like some of those real kind of studio bits done if that makes sense so i just spent some time with mcgillardine chopping up some bits of paper and then i've realized that i need a new printer one because i would really like to be able to offer like small a6 art prints that i don't have to send off for that aren't like unlimited edition they'll be like my open edition prints um because i have a5 ones at the moment and i used those previously when i was doing like my little packages for subscribers to patreon and stuff and i don't do that anymore um so i've got like a bunch left over so i wanted to offer sort of a5 or even a4 open edition prints rather than limited edition prints and then i can just print them as i go but i can't do that with my current printer because it is so infuriating i was toying with the idea of getting a laser printer but i'm not sure how that would handle like a thicker paper so i'm gonna have to do a little bit of research into how it handles everything i think um so that's like what i've been doing this morning i have so many ideas on new products it's unbelievable and i just want to do them all now um let me know in the comments below if there are any products that you want me to bring out for 2023 um what you'd really like but i have some ideas of like a digital downloadable products not just for etsy but for my patrons as well which i think would be really beneficial um so i really want to get working on those and i really want to do all of that but i just need to get these commissions finished but you know when you you're working on something but you really kind of want to work on something else so your attention is kind of a little bit limited i keep having to take short breaks and work at like in short intervals i always find this when i have like a bunch of stuff going on in my brain that i need like someone here with me to talk to me so that i can keep doing my commission and focused on this and then i can talk about these things but i don't have that so i'm currently watching um some catnip studio vlogs because i realized i was so behind i haven't watched like any youtube content or anything in, a, in the longest time so i'm just catching up on some of that um and that's also like getting all of this creativeness is like bringing about all of this stuff <laughs> and i'm like oh, i really like watching these but it's not doing much help for wanting to do other things anyway i've also decided that i'm going to um start filming with this camera on this tripod because it's much easier than having that this tiny little stand on my desk and i always feel like i have to angle it up so i'm always like looking down i don't like that um so yeah i'm gonna start using this tripod anyway this is probably gonna be a longish vlog so i'm pretty i'm, I'm certain i'm gonna cut this off here um hopefully there's like a, a little bit of content that you can enjoy that's not just me talking about my ramblings in my brain um but i hope you've enjoyed this one i will see you guys in next week's vlog where i will be doing a little bit more designing of the note cards and some other things we're going to start to structure 
studio vlogs uh, in the way that I'm like working towards a project end goal um, and like focusing on just the one thing maybe I don't know I've got something in my mind I'm not translating it well with my speech today <laughs> um, but yeah we're going to be just organizing everything a little bit better anyway I'm going to go because my neighbor is talking next door and I don't know if you can hear that so have a great day you beautiful beans and I'll catch you soon <laughs>